Hello Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I'm going to take a look at your situation with you and your person in mind. Remember that this is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate with everybody. You can always take a look at your other placements. You may find some messages there for you. And if you are interested in a personal reading much like this, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you guys. Okay, so I see that you've met someone who you feel very close to, um, you feel very comfortable with, and um, I get that when it comes to you and this person, somebody has been um, juggling a lot when it comes to their life, juggling finances, um, career, and work, and trying to maintain a balance here. So I think that things have kind of been on like shaky grounds between you two in terms of like a commitment so I, I get that right now somebody is like really confused um confused about making a decision whether or not this can work out if there can be a balance between work life and a relationship life so I see there's confusion when it comes to that because we do have a terror moment so there was um some something that really shocked you um some shocking news or something that uh, caused a lot of confusion and caused you to look at things from like a whole a different perspective here um when this this tower moment the moment everything just kind of like came down so now i see somebody's like trying to is really confused um, or somebody's been confused about making a decision here about um, being together. And so, in your person's energy, we have the hand of cards. Take a chance, risk, uh, being strategic, options, not showing hand, and gambling, okay? And so, um, your person, we, we have the judgment here. So, they um i i do get that this person is wa is wanting to make some changes here so they are aware about the fact that there's certain certain things that need to change and i see them wanting to try to uh renew a situation when it comes to you because they still have a lot of um feelings for you here and i get this person wanting to have a, another chance so I see this person um, taking a chance here. Taking a chance on you, taking a chance on this relationship to reconcile things, to have a peaceful resolution and to find balance, to find a way to make you also a priority in their life here and wanting to um, have harmony with you. So they want to bring back the harmony bring back that those happy um good feelings when it comes to you here and get to a peaceful place so this person definitely is aware about the fact that um there has been a lack of a lack of balance in the situation um possibly breadcrumbing or prioritizing work over you, one situation over you. So I see that this is what's causing confusion here is that they're really not sure if like they're the right person for you. And, um, but I see this person that they want to give to you, but there's, um, this, um, the fact that we have the two of pentacles in your in the past most recent past is telling me that this person has been kind of struggling financially here and they're trying to um get to a place where they can give to you and give more time and energy towards you so they're really unsure if this is going to work out 
but I see with the judgment is that they know things need to change and they want things to change here. So there's just the confusion about the fact whether or not you'll accept them. They feel like you may not accept them. And I get that you feel like there's been a struggle here with this five of wands or competition. You feel like you need to compete for this person's time or, or attention here. And we when we have the clock in your in your energy here, it says need time takes time in time cycles, time to heal and progress. So I see that you're you have conflicted emotions conflicted feelings about whether or not you want to work things out with this person here or walk away move away from them but you've already invested a lot of emotions and feelings into this person here so i i kind of feel like for some of you you feel like you've been abandoned here you feel like you've been abandoned by this person and I get that now this is causing like like some conflict for you. You feel like things have been a struggle or you're not really seeing eye to eye and there's really like no teamwork in the situation here. So I see you kind of wanting to take things um, slow and um, take more time to heal things and taking more time to think about what it is that you are really wanting whether or not you want to fight for this connection or you want to go into a different way because i see that there's other uh, factors that are involved that is kind of turning you off and it is um making you feel like yeah i got what i want but it comes with a cost because I'm not getting enough like time or energy from this person or I'm not a priority in this person's life or I'm being breadcrumbed or there's other people around. So it's like it comes with a with a with a catch. You feel like this person comes with a catch and you are now feeling like, I don't know, do I want to work it out or do I want to go into a whole new destination here? So. I do see that in the near future. We have a, I like you. Someone likes you. Romance is blooming. Fun flirting and want to date. Okay, so Knight of Wands. There's this um, communication here coming in for you guys. I see like there's a new beginning with this Ace of Pentacles here. Somebody is wanting to make an investment, wanting to communicate, wanting to have a face-to-face -face conversation here, and wants to tell the truth here. With that King of Swords, I get that now somebody is being more warmer, whereas they've been before um, cold and attached, but this is some clarity and this is the truth that this person is bringing in when it comes to you. And I see that this person has a very strong a attraction towards you, a lot of lust, and this person is coming in very fast and wanting to, to have a new start, wanting to grow the situation and progress it and develop something more here. And with when it comes to a commitment, trying to get things off the ground in terms of this so i see that somebody is now wanting to kind of start to prioritize this situation more so that someone likes you this person is um this person likes you and they they're going to let you know this person is going to let you know here so uh the signs that i'm seeing so far i'm seeing libra i'm seeing capricorn Virgo and Taurus and Leo, Aries and Sagittarius here. So I do get like things are going to get very heated um, between you guys. Things are going to get very, very intense. 
when it comes to this this communication because this person has a lot to say but I get this is this type of energy they're coming in very very quickly and I see you kind of wanting to try to like slow things down here so I am getting that somebody is is walking away or is leaving a situation in order to kind of focus on focus on growth. So I feel like for some of you, you're wanting to focus on your growth and you need more time to make a final choice here. You are needing time to like um, distance yourself before you can make that last decision when it comes to this person i'm getting pisces cancer scorpio energy here so i kind of see like you're wanting to just focus on yourself and your career and your finances and um for some of you you feel like you're not just like yeah this communication happened or it's coming in but what you're getting is just not exactly what you've invested in return so uh, what you're getting here is just not all that you thought it would be or the effort that you have gotten in is just not all what you thought it would be because we're getting the knight of wands energy which is like kind of on and off so i see this kind of being like an on and off thing but let's get some details for you guys So you or this person could be a fair male or somebody who is uh, fair for their cultural background or could have light features. And I have a brunette female here as well. So uh, I see this person making a, a judgment when it comes to you. And I get that um, we have control. So for some of you, you may be feeling like this person is... Um, kind of controlling in some type of way or there's other people involved you feel like um it is kind of controlling the situation or causing delays and obstacles here you or this person could be a young male so i see that there's a young male who likes you someone likes you romance is blooming fun flirting wants a date here so um, this could also be someone who has a, a, a really nice car, like sports car or convertible, but there's destiny that is stepping in here. So there's some unexpected changes, a change of direction here. So your love life is taking a turn and you are moving towards a whole new start. I see you saying goodbye to an on and off thing and moving towards um, the bright person for you here. And um, this was faded. It was meant to happen in order for you to really look at things from an outsider's perspective because I see this person wanting to come back in um, but they're still coming in with this like hot and cold energy here and I, I see that you see right through it so let's get a few more cards for you guys before I close off this reading here for some of you feel like you have no control over the situation, like the ball isn't in your hands, or you may be trying to control the situation and it's just not really um, working out for you because there's other uh, people in the mix. So I see that um, somebody has been looking for, to get some more information about whether or not this was the one. I see that at one point in time, um, you felt like this could be the one and now your person it's it looks like they're the ones here who's making a decision when it comes to you to take a chance and uh, I see that like you're you're getting ready you're getting ready to take action and you're getting ready to kind of just distance yourself so the more that you're not speaking the more that you're detaching yourself is what I see I but I see that there's communication coming in within the next few weeks for you guys here and I get that you're taking the the lead here to 
to do things and to move away from a situation that isn't uh, helping you with your mental health, your emotional health, your spiritual health here. And now you're taking action towards um, getting away from negativity, getting away from things that are not exactly what you've been expecting or what you've been getting in return. And what you've gotten is just not what you are wanting. So I see you moving into a direction in order to make yourself happy. So this is kind of what I'm getting for you um, this week, Libra. If you like this reading, please comment, like, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell so you can be updated for future videos. Let me know if it resonated. And I hope that you found some guidance or clarity in your situation. And thank you for watching. Bye.